I think it's already Saturday, it's day four of the Palm Beach Boat Show and we're always looking for this real new cool technologies that are out there and you guys have got this great product, right? Mm -hmm. It's called New Boat if I'm not mistaken. Correct, yes. Yeah? So what is New Boat? So New Boat is a brand, it's a, a lifestyle that we're delivering right now. We're uh, delivering the confidence, we're delivering the situational awareness into the leisure boat market. Um, doing a lot of the 360 degree cameras on your boat, like we're also aware of with the uh, overhead bird's eye view, every yeah. time we're in our car or truck backing up, we're taking that and we're delivering it into the leisure market. Okay, but it doesn't come from automotive, right? No, it doesn't come from automotive at all. It actually comes from our commercial side, our parent company, yeah. uh, HD Hyundai. So we have this on our commercial ship right now, our, our commercial ship builds as well that we're taking the 360 degree views, delivering it from our commercial market, making it a softer touch, more uh, aesthetically pleasing, and delivering it to our yachting and a uh, leisure recreational market. Good. Because I always like things that are developed mm -hmm. like for the, for the big industry, right? Because that yeah, means absolutely. It's, like, it's cool. Tell me, take me back a bit. Like, what, why was this developed? Like, where does it come from? Because you t you're telling me it comes from commercial, for merchant shipping. Correct, yeah. So it comes from our commercial market where we have uh, our merchant ships, yeah. they were uh, originally trying to downsize on staff and having yeah. so many staff and crew members on board. So we developed this uh, system to implement it on the larger ships to where it was making the ships and the merchants and the captain and the crew just more efficient. Okay, so you're basically saying that because of the tool, like the, the solution that you developed, mm -hmm. well, it, it reduced the necessity of like, well, officers to watch people um, on, on, on Yeah, on so deck, it was the extra watch people, yeah. the additional fatigue on having yeah, exactly. guys 24 hours a day out, but it also helps deliver the, the safety that we're all you know really concerned about we want our our crew members safe we want our family safe as we're traveling so less fatigue a little bit more technology on the boat yeah. and uh you know a little bit of safety and peace yeah. of mind and then you took that proven concept because mm -hmm. i assume it was used by quite a few vessels yeah absolutely and, and we brought that to leisure correct Cool. And what are you aiming for? Is this more for people that I, I own my own boat, I drive my own boat, I want to be safe? Or is it also for crude vessels? What would you think? Like so, so it works for both sides. You have it for the owner operator guys yeah. that have the boats from you know the 30, 40, all the way up to the 60, 70, and 80 foot boats. Yeah. But then also the much larger boats that are crewed with captains, first mates, all the way down the line. It's directed to give the owner operator more peace of mind as he's coming in and out of a marina, yeah. operating his vessel. He gets to see everything around it instead of just what he sees out of the little windows. And he doesn't have to rely on only the person in back on the radio or yeah. yelling up to him on the, you know, what's going on. But it makes sense. And I know that the key question that we will always get asked is one, what about my data protection? Mm -hmm. Well, like especially if I'm like a ultra high network, or I'm traveling with uh, with ultra high network. Safe. There's there's no registration in the cloud or anything where I am, etc. Which like with the, quite a few sonar mm -hmm. systems would be the case. Right. So our system is a closed network system, yeah. a lot like a CCTV. Yeah. It's developed and it's made to be on board yeah. for the owners, for the operators, and being streamed through the MFDs. So we work with a lot of the bigger and you know the major brands out there yeah. that uh, will have you know multiple displays, multifunction displays throughout the vessel. Fantastic. And what everybody wants to know nowadays, it's the buzzword of the of the century. Is it AI driven? So this side is to a bit, there's a little bit of AI in, yeah. involved in everything that we have. So we have a UI that's really unique, unlike yeah. anybody else um, in, our, in our field of what we do. So we have a automated uh, UI that works with distance that will tell you in between vessels, anywhere from three to 16 feet, as you get closer, it'll highlight it, a lot like in the cars, but yeah. instead of just having the little boxes, we actually have a real live UI that's going through all of our cameras and the pixelation, yeah. which draws out a nice little picture for us as well as the live video stream. 
Okay, so it makes it, well, because of that, it makes it easy to comprehend, right? Because Correct, that's, what, yes. that's what it's all about. Yep. I mean, we're all used to having it in our cars, mm -hmm. but like a boat is slightly different. Oh, yeah, there's no brakes. Exactly. You know, you can't stop on a dime. That's what it is. Exactly. Fantastic, Paris. Thank you so much for spending some time with me, mm -hmm. answering all these questions. Absolutely. And we're going to shoot some footage at the Azimut stand, having fun. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.